good morning y'all so we are on vlogmas day one um so okay pause can we just talk this. about how crazy my hair looks right here but it's okay it's not gonna look like that for long just had to add a disclaimer because i look like who did it and why <laughs> Actually, 7 30 in the morning. Did we get any sleep last night? Of course not. <laughs> See, of course not. But it's all good though, because, um, you know, mom life. So I'm about to get her changed and ready so then I can get myself dressed and ready. But I'd rather her already be done I know she has a wet diaper so I'm just gonna change it real quick and get her dressed um yeah how about change her diaper first hey mama
gonna just feed her and get myself ready and then I'll come back when we a little more situated yeah. over here all right y'all so I went ahead and got myself ready um, but I'm gonna get dressed and I just wanted to show you all what my postpartum tummy is looking like we do got some stretch marks as you can see and that is from where my belly button was pierced at so I just basically like to take bio oil and I also take uh, tummy butter and what's that other stuff called um tummy butter and the lotion by cocoa butter formula and I normally use that too but only at night during the, and I use bio oil at night too but during the day like I'll just put on the bio oil and then I will take my and this is me what one almost two weeks postpartum I'm like a week and I'll make two weeks on Thursday so I take my little belly binder and this one is specifically for um postpartum bellies and it just helps bring down the swelling in your uterus and also helps with um just uh so you don't get diastasis with that um it helps kind of bind your stomach back together and kind of get those muscles back into place where they were Just taking this, and then I like to take those two and wrap those two around, and then lastly, I will take the pelvic belt if I can get it <laughs> and wrap that around my seat and then I'll pretty much just pull up everything over that and that is how I am helping with my neck back cutting so as you can see it also smooths everything down but it's gonna help me get my tummy back down to where I want it. So now I'm about to get dressed. All right, y'all. So I'm in the car. I got baby girl. She's back there. I gotta get a mirror for back there. The one I have, like the way my seat is, it's not gonna work for it. Um, but she's back there. She's sound asleep. She likes car rides, so she should be good. Um. But I'm on my way to her doctor's appointment. And yeah, I got myself together and ready. I showed y'all my little, oh my God. It's like a wolf or a deer, all gut scattered out in the middle of it. Anyways, but I showed y'all my little postpartum belt and what I've been doing to kind of help my tummy go down. Um, but yeah, other than that, I really want to stop and get something to eat or some coffee. But the problem is, I can't remember if Cassidy's appointment was at 9 or 9.45. And that's a big gap. So it's 9.07, 9.08. I'm just going to head there right now. It's 13 minutes away. so. But I'm going to use my GPS so I can focus. These eyelashes feel a little heavy on my eyes. Um, and I will talk to y'all again when we get somewhere stationary. <laughs> I finally made it to her appointment. I'm thankfully it was at 9:45 because, honey, this was like a freaking task to get here. Like I could not find this place for nothing. Hold on one second. Like I was saying, like I could not find this place. Oh my gosh! And I'm on the phone with the lady, which keep in mind she was not that good at giving directions, but she was still very helpful. And she stayed on the phone with me the whole time till I found it. So kudos to her because she was bad at giving directions and I was 
because I just couldn't find it. I could not find this place, but I finally got it. And the lady just checked us in and she's gonna um basically call me when she's ready for us to come in. So Cassidy's back there chilling. She ain't made a peep. My baby, she like car rides. She do, because she was quiet yesterday too, um, and sleeping. Which kind of stinks, because I really want to take a nap, because we didn't really get no sleep last night. If you couldn't tell this morning how I was looking, like, we barely slept. And it was cold as hell, and the air condition is in my in-laws room, so I just couldn't, like, get up and go change it, so I had to knock on the door and, like, ask my father-in-law, hey, can we cut the heat on, please? Because he was knocked out, though, and he got home really late, so I know he wouldn't. But couldn't tell anyway how cold it was because he was in a coma. Um, but yeah, I'm just waiting on them to call. Um, once I leave here, I need to go put some air in one of my tires, which sucks because it's so freaking cold. So I might not even do that today. And if I do it, like I'm gonna wait until um, I don't have her with me. I just, I'm real weird about gas stations and having my baby. Like it's just, I don't know. It's um, but I am gonna go to either by the time we leave here, to McDonald's probably won't be serving breakfast anymore, so I probably have to go to Starbucks. Um, <clears throat> cuz I need some coffee and I'm hungry, I'm so hungry. But I was trying to get my baby to our appointment first because I didn't know if it was exactly at 9 or 9 45. But I was like, if they open at 9, I'm pretty sure they wouldn't just make my appointment at 9 unless I requested it. Like, just from working in the medical field before when I was working um, at the dental office back in Nacogdoches, I just remember, like, we never scheduled anyone for 8, even though we opened at 8. You know what I'm saying? Just because it's like, just because you open at that time don't mean you schedule for people at that time. You know what I'm saying? So, it was like, it has to be at 945. And even if it's not, I'll just tell them, like, this is our first appointment. I had a hard time finding the place. You know what I'm saying? I got the car seat, the stroller. It's a lot. It's a lot going on. So, y'all just bear with me. Um, But, yeah, this is her first doctor's appointment. So, we'll see how it goes. It should go good, though. Um, I do have a couple questions for them. A couple concerns. But nothing too, nothing too crazy. I'm going to just get her in here, get her seen, and then I'm probably going to go to the Starbucks. And maybe I'll do a little Starbucks mukbang. And um, answer some questions or something. I don't know. I'll figure out something else to do today. I was supposed to be going to have lunch or dinner with um, one of my friends. So I might be doing that today. That might be something cool to vlog. We'll see. We'll just see how the day goes. And aside from there, I would have to wait until her Gigi gets home anyways. But, yeah, we just in the car, chilling. I got the heat going. I hear her back there. I'm pretty sure she just moving around, though. But I got her bundled up real good because it's freaking cold outside. And I'm already, like, getting a little stuffy. And I don't want her to get sick, so. <sighs> yeah. It's freezing. It was actually snowing last night in Atlanta, so. That's interesting that it was snowing. Y'all, okay. So, I need someone to, one, recommend me how to make my own intro. Because I need to make me an intro. I would just pay someone to do it for me, but I don't want to wait. I don't know. I don't know. But I really want an intro. Like, I want a cute intro for my videos. Like, I don't really care too much about the outro. As long as I'm telling y'all, like, comment, subscribe. But I really want a cute intro. That's one. And then two, I need someone to tell me how to get good music on my videos without getting copyrighted because every single time i go on youtube and i search oh uncopyrighted music blah, 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 i always get copyrighted <laughs> so it's like um listen i want to be able to monetize my videos you know what i'm saying i want to be able to take this shit serious 
it's not okay. This is my time. <laughs> so I really need someone to help me figure out how to do that because I'm like, what the hell? All songs are copyrighted. All songs. Every single song. And especially all the good ones that you want. You know what I'm saying? And I understand it because it's kind of like, you know, the writer and the singer and whoever's like writes to the music. But it's like, what do us regular folk got to do with it? Like, like what do I have? Like, what is me putting your music in my video going to do? Like, does that mean, like, you think I'm trying to say I own it? No. Like, I just want to use it. It's a good song. You should be happy I want to use it. This Dr. Trippin', he come down here with nothing on his arms. <sighs> yeah. Mom life is an adjustment. It really is. Because, honey, I'm tired. I am tired. Yerd. So, I will say, though, she actually slept a while last night. Um, she slept. I want to say I went to sleep probably like 12, 1 o'clock. It was probably more like 1 o'clock, 1 something. And she didn't get up to wine until like 5, I think. Yeah, 4 or 5. Um, which normally she gets up like every two to three hours like on the diets every two to three two and a half maybe you know like but last night she didn't really get up like that um so you know i mean at the same time you have to realize even if she was to sleep through the whole night and wasn't getting up i would just i would still have to set alarms to wake her up because babies have to eat um, every like two to three out two to four hours or something like that anyway so yeah I'm glad she just naturally wakes up with him but she's kind of making some noises back there I might go sit back there with her depending on how long they're gonna take yep let me go see about my baby get some mama baby you want mommy to come back there with you honey let's go back in the back with her Ooh, this wind and this cold is disrespectful. I mean, it's just so disrespectful. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Oh, we, mama. You ready to go to the doctors? I'll see my sure you're good. My baby hat is way too big on her, but she needed something on her head. It's too cold for her not to have nothing. What's on your mouth? You got you got some some milk crust on your mouth? Yeah, she all strapped in here though. Look at her. I wish she would put her head up straight, but but yeah, y'all, we just in here waiting on them to call us but like i said yeah i really do need someone to help me out on music with my um youtube videos because i would love to add effects and music and you know make the videos more interesting to watch it's not just going from clip to clip with me talking and you hearing my voice or like even like a montage type thing you know when you just out somewhere or driving and you just kind of got the video playing and some music playing behind like I would love to do that but I need music come on YouTube and then YouTube offers music like I tried to add some music to my um their music to my labor and delivery vlog but I need to figure out a way I can get it and download it and use it on my editing software instead of YouTube studio soft editing thing because I don't really know how to use theirs I'm not really familiar with it and I was kind of getting annoyed with it very easily like it didn't seem as simple as it should be so I guess if I figure out a way to bootleg that I'll just use that until I can figure out what music I can use that's good and I won't get copyrighted for it but that's my dilemma right now like I really need an intro and I need someone to help me with this copyright music situation because I want to use good music in my videos without getting copyrighted because one, 
I have a potty mouth, so sometimes, you know what I'm saying, a cuss word will slip here and there. That's already putting me at risk. I don't need the music to put me at risk, too, if I can avoid it, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But, yeah, I just have on this comfy ass, well, OOTD. I have on this comfy Converse set. It's a hoodie, some sweatpants, and then I just have on some Adidas shoes. It's giving very much comfortable, very much, I don't care, I'm cold. Oh, mama, what the wrong with the mama, baby? You want your new new? You want your new new? Yeah? You're whining and not even want this thing. But yeah, so. And then Cassidy, she has on a cute little outfit too. Let me show y'all. She has on her jacket and her mittens match her hat and then she just has on some sweatpants and under this she has on a cute little shirt but um because the jacket is actually like a sweatsuit that she has on but um i put it on her because it was just too cold for her not to have anything on her arm and the little thing that we did buy her that's like jacket like it's kind of like a jumpsuit thing but it's like considered jacket material it is not gonna fit in that car seat with her. It's just too puffy and big to fit. So, yeah. But yeah, y'all, I'll check back in with y'all when we're done here. Next time y'all see me, it'll probably be when I eat because I need to eat something. So yeah, I'll catch up with you gals later. y'all so we are officially done at the doctor's office everything went great baby girl looks good she's nice and healthy um they did think she did have a little bit of jaundice um and it it actually has cleared up so it's going away um and she just told me to continue keeping her um like next to windows and in the sun and stuff so it can uh, clear up completely. So she has an appointment in a week just to check on that. But she's nice and healthy and she looks good. Everything, you know, they like say everything's good. So um, I'm about to go get me some food because I'm hungry. Um, I'll probably just stop at the one by the house instead of um, when I hear, because it's 11, so I know I can't go nowhere really get no breakfast like I want to get um but she's done everything went great with her appointment so I'm happy about that um and like I said she has to come back in one week but yeah so mommy duty for mommy duty one for the day is done I gotta go home and tend to my little baby boy my doggy baby um let him stay outside for a little while because I was rushing this morning so he didn't get as much outside time as he I would have liked him to get and I didn't really check to make sure his bowl was full with water and food but I knew I was coming back to the house so I gotta do all that for my doggy baby and yeah um pretty much I'm gonna go back to the house um, I'm going to put on some individual lashes at some point today. And I need to get the bathroom cleaned up today. Um, so, that's my other task. But before I do any of that, me and Miss Cassidy Renee are going to take a nap. She's napping right now, but I'm not tripping because once, you know, all she's going to want to do is get up to eat and poop and burp and she's gonna go back to sleep so I know this is not like after this nap like it's not like oh my gosh she's not gonna sleep again she's gonna go back to sleep again so I'm not tripping and whenever she does I'm gonna go to sleep right along with her girl cause mama is tired okay 
Mama is tired. I went to bed late last night and then we had to be up early this morning. That's why her next appointment, I told him to schedule it for 10 instead of 9 something because at least I could sleep till 8, you know, when I finally do go to sleep. So, yeah, but right now I'm just going to get me some food and head back to the house. And we'll probably chill there for a little bit. Um, I'll probably show y'all what I get from Starbucks. And that'll be that. That'll pretty much be it until I do something again, again today. I'll probably film me like, you know, doing cleaning up the bathroom, getting it organized, and then film something else, you know. We'll probably do mukbang and filming and me cleaning the bathroom. And then um, I'll probably come back on the camera again once I do my lashes. You know, I'm really just planning out in my head times today to vlog. Um, so that way, tonight when I edit um, the video, I want, I'm trying to decide do I want to, I know I'm going to edit it today for sure. But do I want to edit it and post it tonight or do I just want to you know edit it tonight post it tomorrow like i don't know i don't know if i want to have it up tonight so like everybody can have something to watch at the end of their day today or if i wanted to be like okay see what i did yesterday you know kind of thing but i feel like it would be better to do like oh see what i did today i don't know this is the kind of shit that goes on in my head y'all <laughs> so we'll see but i'm gonna go to starbucks so i'll talk to y'all when i'm about to eat